from the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Hello everyone, my name is Brian Mission here for the Penn State Campus Weather Service bringing your Wednesday morning forecast. Now the next couple of days looks to be a mixed bag of everything in terms of the weather from cloudy skies to sunny skies to maybe even some rain as we head into the weekend and Halloween weekend at that. Kicking it off right now with our four main live cameras across Pennsylvania, Lewisburg State College and Pittsburgh, all relatively cloudy skies as we start today, the day today. Off to our east in Philadelphia, looks to be a little bit clearer. Now as we head into State College, 50 degrees as our temperature, feels like a 50. The dew point is at 48, so it's very close to the temperature leading to those cl the cloud cover that you see behind me. We have a north-northwest wind also at 5 miles per hour, which is a whole lot less than what we had yesterday with gusts upwards of 30. Now taking a look locally at the temperatures, 50 degrees as I mentioned in State College, 42 in Johnstown, that looks to be our cool spot as we head southeastern portions of the region, 55 in Harrisburg. And as we expand things out for the rest of the Commonwealth, that looks to be the trend throughout much of Pennsylvania with cooler conditions off to the west and relatively warmer temperatures out east, 57 in Allentown and 46 up near Dubois in those higher elevations. Now, temperature change over the past 24 hours. You can see we're down 10 degrees in Johnstown. So as you step out the door today, it's a little bit cooler than what we had this time yesterday. Down four degrees in State College, down three in Scranton. So yeah, it'll definitely be a little bit cooler as you step out the door. Visibility is still uh, reduced thanks to the fog and cloud cover off to the west. Only a third of a mile, mile in Johnstown, two miles in Bradford, and only five in Franklin as you head eastward. Thanks to the clear conditions, we have 10 mile visibilities out that way. Now, as I mentioned earlier, our wind speeds, we only have a wind speed right now at five miles an hour in State College. It's a whole lot less than what we were dealing with yesterday with gusts upwards of 30 miles per hour. Still some gusty winds as you head off towards the Poconos. We have 18 miles per hour there in Allentown and 15 in Philadelphia. Now our current satellite and radar showing this swirl off to our east that's associated with the nor'easter that's kind of just been meandering its way um, through the, off the coast for the past couple of days now. We, have, we had some lingering showers this morning, but it looks to generally dissipate as we head throughout the day today. It looks to be generally dry and pretty sunny as we head later on into the day today. Now, as we take a broader look at the northeastern part of the country, you can see that nor'easter that's just kind of hanging, hanging around, bringing some rain showers still for the Boston area and even parts of New York and Rhode Island and Connecticut as well that looks to move its way off the coast as we head into the next several days and futurecast really shows that with the cloud cover uh, clearing as we head throughout the day today leaving some mostly sunny skies throughout much of eastern portions and even central portions of pennsylvania maybe even a, a few clouds off to the western portions as we head into thursday you can see some fog forming in the early morning hours and some clouds moving in from our west that's associated with our next rainmaker that looks to impact us on Friday. Speaking of Friday, here is that rainmaker. It looks to be an absolute washout for Friday and Saturday, unfortunately. But luckily, in time for Halloween, it looks to dry out and hopefully get some opportunities in to trick or treat. As we head into Monday, some cloud cover still off to the uh, north and western portion of the state with maybe a few lake effect rain showers thanks to the northwesterly wind. Now for today in State College, we have some, the skies will be clearing throughout the day, with a temperature of 62 degrees. The wind is gonna be coming in from the north at five to 10 miles per hour, but there could still be a couple gusts upwards of 20 miles per hour since that nor'easter isn't really out of the woods just yet. Into tonight, 38 degrees with mostly clear skies with winds calming down a whole bunch. And as we head into tomorrow, 59 degrees with mostly sunny skies with a southeast wind at five to 10 miles per hour. Now, as you head into your seven day forecast, you can see that mixed bag of everything I was talking about earlier. We have a dry period from Wednesday and Thursday, but Friday and Saturday look to be an absolute washout with our next storm system impacting us. Sunday for Halloween looks to be mostly cloudy. Hopefully it'll stay that way in time for trick or treating. And for Monday and Tuesday, we look to dry out once again with temperatures after Thursday remaining into the 50s. From the, from the Penn State Campus Weather Service, I'm Brian Michigan. Have a great day.